All right, we got How Breeze Larson's Captain Marvel workout routine transformed her into a super shero. I knew in movies like this it was going to feel like a triathlon, and I wanted to be ready for it. All right, thank you very much. Let's take a look at this article. Looking like a pancake, gal. Sexy pancake. All right, let's take a look. Continuing on. Brie Larson has been training really hard for her highly anticipated role as Captain Manverse in Captain Marvel. The first female ever in movies. Amazing. A lot of training came from the fact that I was doing an action movie and I was going to have to like do stunts. I didn't know what it was, but I knew in like movies, you got to totally be like a triathlete. In an interview, she gave credit where it was due. Okay, all right, she worked her ass off again. She, let's see what she did. She focused on getting stronger. To help her build super shero strength, she recently she worked with resistance bands, stability balls, and barbells. Typical moves in her circuit included hip thrusts. Whoa. No. Hip thrusts. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yes, I am. Give it yeah. All the way down. Yes, <laughs> Yeah, baby. Amazing, beautiful lady, you know, fantastic person. I got to say, really an incredible actress of our generation. All right, let's see here. Up to four and a half hours of training a day. Sheer volume of these high-intensity workouts help Larson build muscle. But it also challenged her mentally, an essential part of gearing up for a role. I sobbed in the gym many times. (laughs) We can see why. Him. Rust. Oh my god, she's pushing the Jeep. No, you didn't, baby. I gotta see this video. Go, 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 go baby. Go, go, dig, 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 She built rock-solid abs. To build a strong core, she did leg lifts and medicine ball throws. Something that Captain Marvel is known for. Totes. You're sexy. She took up boxing. She worked hard, but remembered to reward herself. Walsh admits that he often pushed Larson past her limits, but also adjusted her plan to make sure she was training in a safe and effective way. The final three months of her training included fight training, fight club, two-a-day workouts four times a week, hour-long sessions twice a week, and one recovery day. To balance her efforts, she satisfied her sweet tooth with treats like cookies and donuts, often after hip thrusts. <laughs> oh, man, she's... I can't wait to see this movie. I didn't know what strength was. I was truly an introvert with asthma before this film, so I had a lot of work to do, and I just started to fall in love with a hip thrust. I started to fall in love with the way my body was changing. It was the first time where I felt like I was making my body work for me. Hmm. Initiative released findings. Yeah, babe, tell me more. 67% of the top critics reviewing the 100 highest grossing movies in 2017 were white males. White males! White males! 